How you doing? My name's Benny. I work for Tony. It's fancy seeing you here at uh, Dana's Tea Palace. They got great tea. I love this place. Also, it's very roomy. Almost looks like you're in a bedroom. But you're not. You're in a tea palace. Anyway. Do you know why I'm here? You have no clue. Do you know who Tony is? You don't know. Well, that's unfortunate, because um, I know you're lying. I know you know exactly who Tony is. And I got to take care of business for Tony. That's right. I'm the guy. I'm the guy that does business for Tony. Now. What? Oh, now it's coming back to you. Now you know who Tony is. Okay. Well, that's good. See, now we're getting somewhere. Basically, you borrowed money from Tony. You borrowed a lot of money from Tony. Now, Tony's a nice guy. He really is. He, like, he, he, he likes to give people money. It's his thing. But he's not a charity case. He doesn't give money and get nothing in return. So, I'm here to collect the money you owe Tony. Plus interest. Yes. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. So, first things first, we gotta figure out how much you owe him. I don't do math in my head. That's not something I do. I'm not that guy. So, I've got a calculator over here, and we're just gonna do some math. Just a second. That's the calculator. Now, let's do some math. A month ago, you took $10 from Tony. Sorry, borrowed. You didn't. You borrowed it until you pay him back. You took it, though. So, I'm going to put $10 into this calculator. Now, a couple weeks ago, you borrowed 99 cents from Tony because you wanted that soda pop. That's okay. That's okay. I understand that. Everybody needs a soda pop every once in a while. So, 99 cents. Then... Not too long ago, you borrowed another nine dollars from him. Big spender, nine dollars. Ten plus ninety-nine cents plus nine dollars equals. Whoa. Nineteen ninety-nine. That's almost twenty dollars. You're a big spender. I don't know. I don't know why you need that much money, and I'm not gonna ask. But that's a lot of money. Twenty dollars. Tony don't. Tony don't just give away twenty dollars. <laughs> Trust me. And I've I've asked him for that kind of money before, and he do, he don't do that. So let's hope that you got the money to pay me back. Sorry, pay Tony back the twenty dollars. You don't got the money. Okay, that's unfortunate. That's really unfortunate. This is gonna be an awkward situation for the both of us if you don't give me that money. So are you sure you don't got that money? All right, that's not good. Because if you don't give me that money right now, I'm going to have to take you out back and I'm going to have to do business. What do you mean? Business? Yeah, business. I'm going to have to take you out back and I'm going to have to ASMR you to death. It's very unpleasant. What do you mean? Is that possible? Yeah, that's possible. I take you out back. You're going to get tingles until you die. It happens. It's possible. You don't believe me? I wouldn't test me. I've done this to so many people. I'm going to 
ASMR you to death. And I'm going to leave you on the side of the road. And Tony's not going to get his money. It's really unfortunate. Nobody wins in that situation. So, let's just figure something out for the both of us. Let's, let's, let's do something. Hold on, hold on. Sorry, my hair is just, just getting messed up and I don't do business with bad hair. It's not something I do. Just a second, I gotta pull something out here. It's dressing me. It's the best stuff. The best stuff. Okay. Sorry about this, this is so unprofessional. I don't know what I, I should have done this earlier. It's just my hair's falling apart and I don't do business like that. I never have, never will. Yeah, I'm that guy. I'm the guy single-handedly responsible for ruining the ozone layer or whatever they're calling it these days. While I'm at it, might as well do this too. I gotta look good. And vibrace. And I think that's cool. So I bought it. enough of that. I shaved. I'm done. Gotta smell good too. Just a second. This is some good stuff. I love the smell of that. Don't you love the smell of that? I love the smell of that. One more thing. Last touch. Got the big glued hand powder. It's good stuff. You should try it. Jesus, gee. Hair maintenance is important to me. It's one of the most important things in my life. Gotta look good. Gotta smell good. Anyway, forget about it. So, sorry about that. That's really unprofessional, I know. But I had to do it. Anyway. You know, I kind of feel bad for what I just did to you. That's very unprofessional. So in return, I'm going to do you a solid. Here's what we're going to do. Instead of me taking you out back and doing business like I was mentioning earlier. I'm going to give you a pass on this one. I'm going to go back and I'm going to tell Tony that I couldn't find you simply couldn't find you but here's what you gotta do for me after we depart from this little meeting you're gonna have to go and you're gonna have to get the money and return it to tony as soon as you can as soon as you can because i don't want to have to come back here i don't i don't want to have to do that i don't care what you gotta do to get the money i don't care if you gotta Get a personal loan, go to check in the cash, take out a title loan. I don't care. You don't, you don't have to tell me. You don't have to tell me. Just get the money and return it to Tony. What? Oh, you can't get a loan because you don't got good credit. Go figure. Well, you know what I'll do for you? I don't do this. I don't do this often. I never do this with people. 
But I feel bad about that episode with the hair. So here's what I'm going to do. I don't want you telling anybody about what I'm about to do. Don't you tell anybody. I've got this hard drive here. This is my personal hard drive. And uh, it's got the names of some businesses and some people who help others out. Let's just say that they'll help you out. They got money they can give you. Now, I'm going to give you the sound drive, but you got to do me a solid. You got to get that money to Tony. So, do what you need to do. Call who you need to call. And get that money. I don't care how you do it. Anyway. What? Okay. You're going to do it. You're going to go get the money. Okay. That's what I like to hear. I like that. I like that a lot. No. Don't make me come back here. Because if you make me come back here, if this has to be part two, if you if you make this part two, there ain't going to be a part three. Okay? I love trilogies. I loved The Hunger Games. It was a great book. Loved them. But I don't do trilogies. I don't do that. I read that, but I don't do that. So, anyway. Oh, Jesus. Hold on. My stupid tie is falling apart. I'm going to have to tie it again. Just a second. Dang tie. I bought it at Walmart. That stupid thing never stays tied. It's so annoying. I wish I could just throw the stupid thing away, but I can't. I don't got that kind of money. Apparently neither do you. Okay, I'm done with the tie. What was I saying? Oh yeah, don't make me come back here. That's what I was saying. So, best of luck to you. And uh, have a nice day. I'm gonna leave now. Can I have one more swig of that tea? Thank you. God, I love that tea. That's a good brew of tea. Anyway, bye bye. And get that money to Tony. I'm not gonna say it again. <laughs>